Hey guys, I recently got a misfire in my Honda and uh, I'm showing you the codes I got and the way I fixed it was changing spark plugs. Uh, since then I do not have, uh, like I've been driving this car for like at least, at least 10 days right now and uh, by the time I made this video and I do not have this issue anymore so uh, you can do, you can fix this by changing the spark plugs and I'll show you how to do that in this video. All right, so to open the spark plug, you have to open these four nuts before that and then remove the cover and then we remove the coils and then we change the spark plugs. So, and make sure you inspect your coils. That's very important too. Here, I'm just trying to open uh, each uh, spark plug, but I couldn't do it with one hand. So sorry for uh, moving cameras all the time. Uh, and uh, then pull coil plugs and I inspect each coil plug if they are they look okay not like crazily damaged or anything so uh, I'm gonna put in order the way I am taking them out so all right to remove the spark plug you need to uh, have this tool and I'm going to leave the tool uh, link in description so if you're interested to buy you can uh, check the description out and I'm going to fast forward all this. All right, before you install the spark plug, you should check the gap and uh, Whatever the gap is listed on the package, it should be within your range. Alright, to install each one, uh, you use the same tool and uh, slowly turn them in. Uh, do not use any force. And do the same thing for all four and at the end we just use a quarter turn uh, to uh, finish this off. Also make sure you do not over tight any of the spark plugs. Uh, it's one fourth turn. I'm just putting back all the coils uh, the way I took it out and uh, same thing just follow steps backward. Now only thing uh, we need to do is re uh, reset the codes and that's it. And thanks for watching the video, hope you find this video useful.